Hello, my name is Jennifer Ibbotson Rodriguez, and I appreciate your consideration for my proposed book, Serving Those Who Served, Self-Care for the Caregivers of Disabled Combat Veterans with Traumatic Brain Injuries. I am dedicating this teaching memoir to the caregiver who isn't caring for themselves, who is overwhelmed by feelings of guilt and shame, who feels inadequate for the one that they love the most. My proposed book provides them permission to secure their own oxygen masks first, even when the plane is spiraling out of control. It provides easily actionable assistance to customize a daily self-care routine they can feel good about. You see, self-care was not a foundational skill set of mine prior to my marriage. After, there was no time to consider anything other than the veteran I'd accepted full responsibility for. Asking for help over the years is what first brought the police to our door. It is what alienated me from friends and family. And it's what's made me look worthless to his parents. So I've learned to address my fears differently. I've learned to seek guidance from farther confidants. I've learned to accept the support from the single being most invested in me, me. This is the story of how I pulled myself up from the combat bootstraps of isolation during the darkest of possible times. This is the story of how I released the past and accepted the future to find comfort in the now. This story is also an invitation for you to join me, to become a like-minded traveler along the road of your own well-being. You deserve your own care, no matter what is going on. You deserve to feel supported, no matter who isn't there for you. Because you deserve to become the most expert caregiver to the one who deserves your care the most, you. Serving those who served self-care for the caregivers of disabled combat veterans with traumatic brain injuries is a gifted solution for the unsupported selfless caregivers who deserve to have a fully developed low cost survival plan they can use to save the day every day. Each reader will finish this book knowing they are not alone. They are loved and they are enough. From all of us, thank you for caring.